Good evening, Kickstarter Live. We are once again back at my house, two blocks from Full Circle Bar Austin, where we were last night and had an incredible, excuse me, a spin credible show live in front of the classic ski ball lanes. We played Target Tops, which is Gradle Ski Ball, uh, simultaneously as we were playing Ski Ball, Ski Ball, the real game. You weren't there. It was amazing. Dreidel ski ball and real ski ball for the first time probably in history happening at the very same time. It was a blast. Floater, one of the best ski ball players in the country, took down, um, guilt down on it in a very heated battle of dreidel ski ball and real ski ball. Um, welcome, everybody. It is the fifth night of Hanukkah. Woo! Aren't you guys excited about that? Woo! Synagogue Kickstarter campaign, and I always start off the show with a little update on our progress, spinning towards our goal of 18,000. Today, we are currently at 12,138 pieces of guilt. Oh! That would not be possible without 273 backers of the synagogue. Thank you so much. Nine days in, 12 grand plus. The goal is 18,000. We are spinning right along. Let's keep up the momentum. Um, it's night five of Hanukkah. We got a few more of these crazy nights to look forward to. Um, it would be so cool if by the eighth night of Hanukkah, we can reach our goal. That would be spectacular. It's fantastic. In fact, wouldn't you agree? It's been incredible. Ooh, yes. <laughs> yes. Thanks. Thanks. Um, all right. So it is the fifth night. And uh, before we get into uh, the synagogue game of the night, which is dueling dreidels, um, let's take care of some Hanukkah business and light these candles, make this fifth night official. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, Asher kishanu b'mitzvotam, V'tsivanu lehalit shel ha. All right, look at this, guys. This is one of my favorite moments of Hanukkah. It was as a kid when you, you take that leap to the other side of the menorah. You know, we've been over here for these four days, and we're about to jump over the Shamus candle and light that fifth dude. There he is. Very exciting. All right. Boom. All right, fifth night is official. If you already lit your candles at home, I hope they're burning brightly. Um, we have a very special menorah here. Um, it's called a beer can menorah. And, um, you know, I'm living in Texas now. Um, I'm from Brooklyn originally. And uh, I've been embraced here uh, like you wouldn't believe. It's just, uh, it's been an unbelievable uh, couple of years. And I have so much love around me and they haven't just embraced me but they've embraced sort of my brooklyn jewishness too i have to say and uh it's it's i never thought in my wildest imagination that major league dreidel and the spinagogue would really not just thrive in austin texas but take off again in austin texas and so to pay homage to all that love that's been around me in this game since i've been here um we have an austin beer works Beer can menorah with obviously the uh, the lone candle in the middle being that that lone star. Um, 
All right, well, let's get right to it. We are going to play a game tonight that's called Dueling Dreidels. Yeah, very exciting. This game is a lot of fun. It is a spinning showdown where anything is possible. Uh, you can play it really with, uh, I would say, three or more spinners, but it is best played. Um, and, and, and the possibilities become more endless when there are six players spinning simultaneously in the spinagogue. The spinagogue, as you know, comes with six different colored dreidels. It's great to put them all in use, all in play uh, for dueling dreidels, and we're going to do just that tonight. I got to uh, introduce the folks here with me that we're going to duel with against. I'm going to duel my dreidel against Sarah O right here. Sarah O Hanukkah is her official spinner name. Sarah <laughs> O Hanukkah. Uh, this is uh, Will. Um, do you have an official spinner name? I don't have a spinner you name. Don't? Okay, you will by the end of the night. Perfect. And uh, everybody knows who you are by now. She was uh, one of, I don't know, she was the star of the Kickstarter spinning gun video that we put up. Um, it's the first video that you see on the page and really sort of, you know, explains what the spinagogue is and, and explains why, you know, we're doing what we're doing, trying to reinvent and revitalize this, this ancient game. Cheryl was a star, was the star of that video, the star of David of that video. Uh, <laughs> so Cheryl, welcome back, welcome back. Thanks, thanks, thanks Cheryl. Uh, we have uh, two other spinners in the house here. We got the uh, Spin Up Girl, uh, and uh, we got uh, and Motley Jew over here. Where's your, where's your cat, Motley Jew? There he is. All right, wave to the people. Hey, people. Cool. Dr. Rickman's <laughs> back in the house. All right, so we have our six spinners for dueling dreidels, um, and uh, I always start every game by explaining, um, number one, what zone should be in the spinagogue for that game. For dueling dreidels, because there are so many spinners involved and the action is just super intense, um, we take out both spin zones, and we, we keep it in spin zone number one, and uh, we actually don't even use a game terrain for this. Um, we play right here on the MLD hardwood court. Um, it's beautiful. I Zamboni, Zambonied it earlier today. <laughs> I guess you only Zamboni ice. <laughs> Typically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I polished it. It's a spirit. Um, it's a spirit. So let's go over, before we start playing this game, let's go over some dueling dreidel rules. Um, you start, like I said, with anywhere from three to six players. Every player first picks their color dreidel. I have the yellow one right in front of me, so I will be yellow. Uh, ironically enough, in dueling dreidels, one of the six dreidels is always the magic dreidel, and that dreidel is the yellow dreidel. So I'm starting with the yellow dreidel. Go ahead and grab your dreidels, everybody. Okay, Sarah Ohanika is green. Guy who doesn't have a name yet is green. Uh, blue. Oh, blue. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> He's also colorblind. Cheryl is so also you're, green. Cheryl <laughs> is also, also green. Um, Always green. Cheryl's orange. Always green. Dr. Whitman, Motley Jew is purple, and Spin Up Girl is red. All right, so everyone has chosen their dreidel. Um, and like I said, the yellow dreidel is always the magic dreidel. And that's important because. That's what dueling dreidels is all about. Whomever is spinning the magic dreidel uh, is playing against the entire spinagogue. It's the magic dreidel spinner versus everybody else. They're all on the same team. They're trying to kill any way they possibly can the yellow dreidel. Now, the whole goal of dueling dreidels is to try to be, when you have the magic dreidel in your hand, the last dreidel spinning and it's no easy task because like i said you have well tonight five vicious dreidel spinners looking to take you out um and so the the magic dreidel uh is passed around uh clockwise and so you have one spin with magic dreidel and if you can get a point by being the last dreidel spinning right you get to keep spinning but if you get knocked out and killed before you are the last dreidel spinning, then your turn is over and you pass the magic dreidel uh, to the left. And everyone else passes their colored dreidel to the left as well. So you just keep moving the dreidels around the circle. It's really fun. It's like hot, hot dreidel, hot potato. 
there's some potatoes right there. We'll get to those in a second. Um, <laughs> but yes, you pass the magic dreidel around the circle and everyone gets a shot. Um, if you do uh, outlast all the other dreidels in the spinagogue, you get to spin again. Typically, you could play to first to three points uh, tonight um, because it's really difficult to be the last dreidel spinning when you have the magic dreidel because um, the odds are not in your favor. Um, well, I guess we'll play to one point. I guess the first person to uh, to have the magic dreidel and, and be the last dreidel, dreidel spinning yeah. wins the whole wins the whole thing wins uh all the gelt from geltosaurus and all of the gelt from uh the latka ness monster <laughs> the latka ness monster just gobbles up all the gelt kind of. okay all right um so the way this is started is everybody puts their hand over the spinning surface, Reach. Yeah. like so, watch out for the mic, not mic. Um, and so as you can see, it looks pretty fun. Um, it's pretty hostile in there, so be careful. Um, now what's fun about this is that the person with the magic dreidel um, also has to say one, two, three, test run guys, one, <laughs> two, three, spin. And when they say spin, everybody must spin at the same time. Um, now, leading up to that, it's kind of like uh, football, right? When a quarterback um, is kind of like, you know, like, uh, I don't know, what's what one, two, three, hut? Well, no, I'm, 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 it's more like, like, you know, like Red Rover, Red Rover, you know? Blue 57, Blue 57. Um, yeah, one of those things. Um, and they can try to draw the offensive line, um, or not the offensive line, rather, but the defensive line off sides. So, you you can you can actually, however, move while you're actually calling out one two three spin, and that's a fun part of it. Is I could be like one two three, and they're trying to understand where I'm going to spin the dreidel because they're trying to attack, and so I'm trying to like juke them one way or the other and try to find some some open land, some open territory in the spin zone, so I could potentially be the last dreidel spinning. Everybody um, can move or just yellow. Everybody can move, uh, but I'm trying to like fool you as Take to like out. where you think I'm going to release the dreidel. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Down. Say it. Get one. <laughs> Hot route. Hot route. No. Okay. Uh, all right. So, so here we go. We're gonna, we're gonna start. Draw us off sides. I have the magic dreidel. Here we go. This is for wheels. One, two, three. Spin. Oh. oh. <laughs> It was between me and the red dreidel, and the red dreidel won. So uh, no point for me. I pass the, the magic dreidel to the Maybe. left. Everyone passes their dreidel. Okay. One over. Yeah. You should be blue. Okay. You're supposed to hand it to me. And now uh, <laughs> I'm to do the, spinner, the spinner without a name, the spinner without a name is up. You're the magic dreidel. Right. One. Two, three, spin. Oh, you were <laughs> dead. Was dead. He died <laughs> instantly. I think blue might have been late last. That was awesome. I forgot my color. Is that orange? I don't know. Blue. Cheryl's the magic dreidel. <laughs> and then I'm red. Okay. All, All right. right, Cheryl. So no points so far. Oh, well, I guess whoever gets the first point with the magic dreidel wins. One, two, Three, spin. Oh man, you were early. You were early. That was a false start, a false spin, as they call it. Um, but uh, yeah, that was cool. That was like annihilation. Everybody died instantaneously on that one. Spin instantaneous. <laughs> oh, you know what? Uh, we came up with a really good name the other day that I never heard before, and and I think you should be it. Um, spin shady. Spin shady. Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so this is actually a good time the to bring up. We're gonna, do a, we're gonna do a, like a little ask everybody to post their uh, spin names. That's right. Comments. That's right. We're gonna reach out to all the backers out there, and we're gonna ask you guys to uh, uh, send us your dreidel spinning name. Uh, typically, they are outrageous and funny and punny. Spin Credible Hulk, Spin Glorious Bastard, 
um, Spin Indiana Jones, Gentile Giant, the Gentile Giant, <laughs> Goy Toy, Goy Wonder. You know, everyone gets involved. Um, what else? Ooh La Latka. One of my favorites of all time was Yom Kippur. Some sugar on me. <laughs> Genius. I wanted to give him the trophy. Alex Ford. He's actually an air guitarist. His name is uh, Ricky Stinkfingers in the air guitar circuit. But uh, when he's spinning dreidel, he's, he's young. He pours some sugar on me. Incredible. Okay. I have three dreidels in my hand. Why? It's not legal. Uh, uh, you're green. Yeah. You're green. You're green. Okay. Um, so yeah, look out for that that email. Um, we're going to ask you for your spinner names, and, and maybe we'll do a, like a fan vote for the best one. Uh, okay, all right, Dr. Wickman. All right, one, two, three, spin. Oh, I went early. Uh, I think hey, right? we, we collided hands. That was cool. <laughs> all right, you're yeller. All right. right. What color are you? Color was, I was, I was green. green. You were green? Uh-huh. What color were you? Purple? Yeah. Okay, spin up, girls, up. All right. A rough one. One, two, Three, spin. Mm, wow. I told you guys, this is like, this is extremely intense. The drills inside of the spin zone are, I mean, they, they're, right. they're aggressive. They're aggressive. And, and a lot of times you get what, what, uh, what we just had right there, which is just a total yes. annihilation um, where all the drills just in a heartbeat just die instantaneously. What well, spin tentaneously. Spin tentaneously. Spin ten ten. Um but spin -ten -ten. I, 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 I'm waiting for one of you guys with the magic dreidel to figure it out because I we have not been fooled. Clearly we have not been fooled yet. Here's what's maybe Sarah O'Hara ah. will fool us. Oh hang on. Spin ten ten is just fine. Ah. Okay. Alright, one, two I see you. And three. No, uh, that was close. All right, it's made its rounds. All right, so it's made it back to me, which means no one was the last dreidel spinning when they spun the I magic started. yellow dreidel. I feel good about this one. Though. I can't remember. I just start with one. Yeah, we're back. <laughs> oh, no, Cheryl. Cheryl, <laughs> Cheryl. classic Cheryl. Cheryl. Watch your hand on the microphone. I don't people see yours at home. <laughs> I think that's really good. It might have been the potatoes. It could have been the potatoes. Um, well, that, that was a good segue into backthespin.com, <laughs> folks. That's our new snazzy URL. If you want to uh, promote the Spinagog Kickstarter and tell your friends and family and your colleagues now that work is back in action, um, tell them to go to backthespin.com. It'll take them right to the Kickstarter page um, where they can back the Spinagog. Um, all right. Here we go. I got the magic dreidel. Let's do this. One, two, three, spin. No! Caught you off guard. Caught you off guard. Caught you off guard. Caught, you off guard. Caught me off guard. She didn't know we were. She didn't even see it coming. <laughs> All right, so I am going to pour some gelt out of Geltosaurus into the Lockness monster, and I am going to drink it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Such a ham. Any uh, questions from the audience? Uh, we do not currently. Nope, no current. No questions. questions. All right. Well, if you have a question about dueling dreidels or any of the other games, let us know. Um, uh, we're going to wind things down here. I just want to uh, let you know what we're doing tonight after. Uh, the show here, we're going to take these potatoes and we are going to do exactly what you do with potatoes around this time of year. We're going to dice them up and we're going to fry them up and we're going to put on the movie Die Hard, which by the way, if you don't know this, um, I, I, I didn't know this until this year and it was told to me by a very good friend of mine, Gelta Force is a spinner. Um, he has an argument and it's, it's pretty damn um, pretty damn good. Uh, it's, it's hard to poke any holes in it. Um, he claims that Die Hard is not a Christmas movie like the world thinks it is. Yeah. He said, he said, and he has a very valid argument as to why, 
Die Hard is a Hanukkah film. Yeah. Look him up. Eric Schulmiller is his name. He's a cantor in uh, New York City. Um, he's also one of the best spinners of all time. Um, he claims that Die Hard is a Hanukkah film. Um, and uh, after reading his article, I actually agree. Um, that said, anyway, uh, we're going we're gonna to fry these up and uh, we're going to watch Die Hard while we fry hard. <laughs> huh? Yeah. yeah. Uh, the Jane Austen Dubano? Oh, that's right. Uh, tomorrow night uh, is December 29th. Uh, at Full Circle Bar Austin, we are going to have a Major League Dreidel Hanukkah party. It's going to be the sixth night. And uh, yeah, yeah. We're going to play a ton of different Dreidel games. The Spinagogue will be there, and we will have uh, the Major League Dreidel Spinometers out, keeping time. Uh, we are going to be playing the long version of Target Tops, which, if you haven't seen it, it is just a beautiful Dreidel game. Uh, it's sort of a marriage between two iconic American games. Uh, shuffleboard and cornhole, um, but it's for dreidel. And, and and this game, I have to say, probably among all the other dreidel games that we have here, um, Target Tops, when it's played on the eight foot long table, um, is probably the most uh, m the one that most resembles a true sport um, because there is a lot more motion involved. You you don't, you don't just have to spin the dreidel um, upright um, in place. You have to spin the dreidel the length of the table. So you're actually moving your arm and releasing the dreidel um, in a very fluid way. And it's, it's not very intuitive. It takes a lot of time and a lot of touch. Um, but when you do get it and you spin that dreidel the length of that eight foot table and you get close to that hole, so my good. God, are things <laughs> really, really exciting because when that thing goes in, if it goes in, it's called a spinny dip and uh, the crowd goes crazy. You'll see tomorrow. Um, so tomorrow, 8 o'clock, uh, the dreidel tournaments will start, but at 6 p.m. Uh, until midnight, a very special sandwich uh, will be served by the guys who do all the amazing food at Full Circle Bar. Cafe Ebor Food Bus will be making what they're calling a, a, a pastrami Cuban sandwich, a.k.a. the Jubano. <laughs> pastrami Cuban, the Jubano. It is amazing. <laughs> Uh, it is thinly sliced, sliced pastrami that's served hot with Goulden's spicy brown mustard. Of course, it's Goulden's. Um, and uh, yeah, it's served, it's served on with, uh, we can get it with Swiss cheese if you'd like or not. Um, and then they put it on Cuban style bread, which they press. And it is, uh, for a Brooklyn kid, man, it is, it's pretty damn close to... Uh, Carnegie Deli, which, by the way, Carnegie Deli is shutting down after like that. forty plus years in business. It is, yeah. it is really sad. Um, that is really sad. It's really sad. But you know what, though, we're keeping the pastrami sandwich alive here in Austin at Full Circle Bar with the Jubano. So come on by from six to midnight. They'll be serving Jubanos. Um, get one. It comes with a beautiful pickle, and uh, I think there's an option for some sauerkraut too. Um, okay. Okay. And we will be live streaming parts of that part. Oh, yeah. And we're going to be live streaming um, the championship match of Target Tops. We'll also be playing Bupkis, another game, um, which is really fun. It's, it's sort of a, a really fun, uh, more involved uh, version of traditional dreidel um, where uh, it's, again, left up to chance, um, and it's a betting game. But uh, unlike regular dreidel where just one of four things can happen every time, Bupkis takes it to a whole new level, and it's sort of like dreidel craps. Um, um, but instead of uh, shooting dice, um, a spinner is spinning a dreidel, and you have people crowded around this table betting on all the possibilities, not just what the dreidel face lands on, but where the dreidel lands on this uh, very customized uh, spinning board. So uh, and all that money is going to go to uh, to charity this year. Where's it going, Wiki? Uh, I don't know where this year's, last year's went to the Elridge apartment set right. up for a book drive. Uh, oh, we, we, were, we were doing the same? Uh, we might do okay. the same. Uh, well, no. we'll, we'll, let, you, we'll let you know before the night drive. starts where the, the bupkis uh, money is going to go. But it's, it's uh, Dreidel Craps for charity. Um, so tune in. That, we're going to start that broadcast around 9 Eastern, um, and the championship match will probably be around 9.30, 9.45, um, towards the end of the broadcast, I imagine. Um, and I think that's it. So, you know, uh, we weren't planning on doing this every time, but people just they keep on saying, like, where's the guitar? We want the guy with the guitar that was in 
Spinagog Kickstarter Live episode number two. Um, his name is Cooper. Um, he's not here again. Um, I'm not sure where he is. I think he's still recovering from Christmas. Um, he had a lot of meatballs. Huh? A lot of meatballs. He had a lot of meatballs so on Christmas. Um, so we do have the guitar here. We're going to bring it in, and uh, we're going to do what we've been doing to close out every show. Uh, it just makes sense and feels right. All right, if you know the words, join in. If you don't know the words, Google them like we just did. <laughs> uh, it's the dreidel song, people. A one, a two, a one, two, three. I have a little dreidel. I made it out of clay. And when it's dry and ready, then dreidel I shall play. Oh, dreidel, dreidel, dreidel. I made it out of clay. And when it's dry and ready, then dreidel I shall play. It has a lovely body with legs so short and thin. And when my dreidel's tired, it drops and then I win. Oh, dreidel, 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 I made it out of clay. And when it's dry and ready, then dreidel I shall play. New verse. <clears throat> it's five nights old. Everyone's starting to really get this verse and enjoy singing this verse. And uh, tonight, I think we're going to really hit it with that, that six-part harmony that we've been trying to get. Um, all right, the new verse goes a little something like this. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> the spin of God is awesome, like luck is made by mom. The gift that keeps on spinning. What? Oh, hang on. What did you say, Cheryl? Spinning. Why don't you just sing it by yourself? One, two, Which three. Which part? The, the last verse. Spin a gong is awesome, like luck is made by mom. The gift that keeps on spinning at backthespin.com. Good night, everybody. Uh, did we get any uh, any new backers while we were on the air? No new backers while we were on the air? Where's that triangle at? Can I see that triangle for one second? I want to test something. Okay. We've been ringing this triangle. I don't know if everyone knows this, but we've had this triangle at the bar uh, for the length of the Kickstarter campaign. And every single time that we get a new backer, regardless of the uh, the pledge, it could be a dollar, it could be uh, double high, 36, uh, doesn't matter. Every single backer that we get, we ring this bell. And it is so fun because everybody lights up wherever they are in the bar, whatever they're doing, they all look up and they all clap. And uh, it's, it's really, really magical and really, really fun. And so we're hoping to do it live um, on, every night. on this stream every night. So yeah. I don't know. I don't know if everyone that's watching is a backer and is already backed, but it would be amazing if we got a backer right now so I could go. Um, so we'll give it 10 seconds <laughs> and we'll see. 273. 273. Come on, come on. 273. It's like a telethon. 273. <laughs> it's a spin a thon. <laughs> we should have a spin a thon. I think I'm just going to stay up for the, remest the, the remainder of the campaign. How many days are left? 27, 27. days left. <laughs> I'm just going to stay up and, have, and spin and make sure one dreidel is spinning at least. Like if one like one starts to die, I, I start spinning another one, and the dreidels never stop spinning for the next 27 days. All right. Like well, a, like a spinner. Should I ring it just so people get an understanding of what it sounds like? No, no it's bad luck. No. Okay, yeah, you're right. It's sacred. It has to be real. It has to be real. Okay. Well, anyway. This is what we're doing. It's really fun. And we want to ring, 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 ring in the new year with this sucker as many times as we can. You can ring my bell. I saw that. I saw that. Okay. <laughs> Good night, everybody. Happy fifth night. Good night. Thank you so much. Let's keep this Thanks baby spinning.